Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel. It has been a hot minute, I know. Um, it was half term last week, so that's why I didn't get to film anything other than the weekly vlog, because I had Jennifer all week. Uh, Paul only had a couple of days off. Um, but there you go. Anyway, this is my completed pages. I know it's June the 5th or whatever it is. But like I said, I didn't have time to do it last week. I've got a lot of videos to do this week. I'm just trying to catch up, so. Apart from that, I'm feeling a little bit ill. I've got a little bug at the moment, so I'm not really feeling like doing very much. But I've got a spare minute or two, so I thought I'll go through all the pages I completed in May. There wasn't many. Again, partly because Jennifer was on holiday, so we were out and about doing stuff. Partly because my mind kept wandering to my dad when I was colouring. And I found reading took more concentration, therefore it was easier to block out those feelings reading. So when I do my reading wrap up, you'll see there's like 20 books. Yeah, that's why. Um, but I did colour a few and I like what I've coloured and that's all that matters. So let's get started. So the first uh, one I've got to show you is Tropigoth by Carla Magana. Let me just zoom in slightly. There we go. And this was a buddy colour with a molly wasn't that one <laughs> and it was this one this was uh, for Mermaid so we did that one together so and this was again downstairs so it was using various markers and I think yeah various markers various glitter gel pens and gel pens so yeah but I enjoyed doing that it was a really nice one to do I did try and start dating them last month and then I forgot and I, like I said I did that one on May the 5th and again I started late last month so and another buddy colour with Molly Newland was from Mermaid Special uh, which was a colour in heaven one this is issue what issue is it it's on here somewhere 87 I'm sure it says it on the side yeah it does issue 87 and we did this one and I did this using some pencils. I'm going to say Black Widow because I have the Black Widows are downstairs. But I didn't want it to be really bright and thing. I wanted a nice muted colour. So, yeah. It would have been Black Widows. So, I actually enjoyed that. It looks really nice. I like the shell. Um, listening to a shell. Yeah. No sparkles on that one. Just a plain old colouring with a bit of shading. Not a lot because... I don't. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so that was uh, another buddy colour with Molly Newland. I did one in the Comfy and Cozy colouring book. This is Jade Summer's new Simple series that they've been putting out. Um, I did a flip through of this one. And these are really simple pictures. And I did this one of the uh, animals camping. I like this book. I'm going to keep this out and do another one in this one. I think because I do like that book. I think it's really cute. So, so I did one in there. And again, this is just my various markers because they were down done downstairs. So it's a touch, the touch markers from TikTok, Shuttle Arts. I'm trying to think what else is done there. There's a, ooh, all sorts, it's just a mixture. I mean, this green at the top was a, was a, was a, a, a pen from, uh, Liddles and, and so on but yeah that was a nice one to do and I, I did a little bit there with the I think I think that's right what did I take yeah it was alcohol markers I was really nice. I like that I, I like that little book I'm gonna keep that one out put it to one side uh, Graveyard Girls by Akala Magana this was a buddy hello with the lovely Chelsea and it's this one and I did it with red hair and sort of a burnt gold, rose gold background, which was two metallic colours mixed together, which was gold and bronze. It's more bronze than gold, but it's not. It's how I wanted it, and it looks nice. And I gave her red hair. She actually reminds me of Maestro from <laughs> the current series of Doctor Who. But, uh, yeah, that's another story. Um, but, yeah. So I was watching while I was colouring this. I thought, oh, but I thought I'd give her red hair rather than orange. Um, but yeah, again, I enjoyed that, and it's again, other than the acrylic paint, which was from Watt, which is a, a, a DIY shop that also sells craft supplies, among other things. It's all various markers, so. Another buddy collar with Molly. <laughs> we did a lot this month with Molly, it's great, I love it. Was one from 
a million unicorns and I think pretty much every picture in here that I've done has been a buddy colour with Molly and we just did this one at the end again a mermaid one and this was done using the Oh Hoo Hoo water brush markers because they seem to work really nicely in this book and then I've got some uh, this glitter gel pen down here is the Calm Over Chaos glitter they are so sparkly it doesn't really show on the camera how sparkly they are but they are very very sparkly uh, pictures uh, pens and they're fabulous I did one in Created Haven Creative Haven Dimensions so this is by John Wick I love pattern books this was mad doing this but this is the one I did and this is just using the Link Shine gel pens you can see how sparkly that is look at it <laughs> um, with all the pattern books I do tend to start at the beginning and work my way through like that but I like that that one's a nice one like I said that was all Link Shine took ages another book I really love is this one from Sunlight is it Sunlight yeah Sunlight Drawing which is 100 best colour by numbers <laughs> which has, um, excuse me sniffling, different ones from all their different books and I'm, again I'm doing this in order because I do a colour by number books I, I did this one of the Spanish Dancer which was really nice it was fun, I made a couple of mistakes but I'm not worried about that Yeah, I do like this book, I try and do at least one every month in that one because they are just so relaxing again various markers because this was done downstairs so they, we've got touch markers we've got uh, shuttle arts we've got bowl not bowl mint uh, Crillando in the background I believe and so on so yeah I like that work I'm gonna keep, I'll keep that one out because I will do something in there uh, another colour by number I did was uh, dinosaurs page of some of them Jennifer's got this book as well um, when I did this page inside which is let me get past the cover page this one again this was done with Crelando markers mostly and um, a few others there's no grey so that was probably from uh, like stock of various markers but it's such a cute little book it doesn't take long to do they are so cute these little dinosaurs look at that how can you not oh his face not want to colour them they're so sweet um i don't know if i'll do one in this month but you never know i might do yeah. um next i have we're on to the ones i'm working on the books to try and finish them at some point i only coloured in four of the ones i've got left or rather i only completed four i am still working on the car um the um camellia angel cover one which i'm really not going to worry about but i like colouring in it so i will continue to colour in that periodically I'm getting to a point now where I can really finish the picture I'm working on hopefully in June. June is my birthday month. It's a big year this year. I'm turning 50. It doesn't feel like I'm that old. It still feels like 1984 but there you go apart from you know obviously losing my dad. Um, but yes it's my birthday and I have no idea what I want. Uh, my mum's giving me money. Paul's taking me out to dinner. We were going to the theatre but that's been cancelled because we've got no one to look after Jennifer and that's okay we don't mind we can manage um but you know what? i'm not really bothered about presents i just want to be with my family that in the fact it's the first birthday without dad so it's gonna be really weird chibi girls volume two a blamber i did chibi dance club so this has got some of the calm of a chaos glitter gel pens on it let me just zoom it in a little bit various markers again because you know but the background itself is crayon both parts of the background so this blue bit is crayon and the black is just a Crayola, a Crayola crayons that I thought I'd use just to have a look I like this book I'm really enjoying colouring it I'm gonna have to see what I'm gonna do next it's a really good little book and I know that there's two of everything so when I do finish my set I'll pass it on to Jennifer and she'll colour in it so keep that one out I did one in the colour by number mandalas I buy a jade somehow find it and it was this one again this was done whoops using all the various markers I have uh, upstairs downstairs rather because um, now I am shuffling for certain colours those mostly being the purples I don't know why 
and sometimes oranges it's just deciding which oranges because there's so many oranges in these books it's ridiculous but never mind so yeah I did that one and I do like it one and then I've got color by number flowers by Jade Summer again the same issue with the oranges and the purples but I did this one and I actually quite like this one I think it's a really pretty vase with the flowers on it I like that really really nice so obviously I'm going to uh, do some more in this one. I know I'm not going to finish it. I'm, there's 50 images. This is a book only on image date one. But I've enjoyed colouring it. So I want to keep going with that one. And Rose Windows by Creative Haven, Joel S. Avron. This book I will be finishing in June. I've got one page. One page left to do. Yay! And it's this one right at the back. Let me find it. Let me find it. So... Um, and I'm going to buddy it with Molly but it's this one so I'll be doing that one very soon but I did this one again this is just using the Creelando art markers the original set that I got from Lidl's they will just go into my markers my random marker set once I've used them all up once I finish this book because I've kept them specifically for this book although I do use them in some of the others and that's it that is all I have actually colored this month it's not very much but like I said it was a very hard month this month however I hope you've enjoyed this I can't say I've got a favorite one I think all the buddy colors I think maybe my I don't know my little mermaid from the current heaven one's pretty cute I like her but that's it I hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one bye guys